Hi, James from Car Family here. Just showing you uh, the newest addition to our stock, a lovely BMW 5 Series uh, 12 plate, having done 130 odd thousand miles. I think it's low 130s, but I can always double check that when checking the interior. Um, yeah, so we got this in as a part exchange, um, and as you can see, it's looking really nice. It's just had a polish. Um, it's got a long MOT uh, on the car. Uh, very good service history also, two two keys with the car um, and it's also got a lot of added features that come with the car, you know, it's a very high spec um, BMW, I, I believe it's called the Merino Champagne Leather uh, Interior Pack, um, you know, it's got your rear and front parking sensors, your nav, Bluetooth, USB inputs, heated front and rear seats, uh, really nice amount of boot space also. Um, and it, it, it is just a lovely drive. I've driven this myself for about, you know, a good 30 miles and, you know, it's such a smooth ride, these uh, these BMWs, um, and it's such a classic look also. Uh, but yeah, so I'm just gonna show you all the necessary bodywork defects that the car may have. Um, and yeah, if it, interests, if it interests you, we love um, to hear back from you. So yeah, I'm just gonna start with the driver's side door. Um, uh, apologies about um, the, bits of water there but as you can see in really nice condition there you know no dents no scratches um, I'm, I'm gonna try and be as picky as I can you know for example the wing overall is really good but there are just you know a couple of stone chips as you'd expect on a car of this age and mileage um, you've got the bonnet here again in lovely condition but you will just be able to pick up you know stone chips on the front of the car that it's picked up over the years i mean if you find a bmw that's done a similar amount of mileage and the age of the car and it doesn't have those stone chips then you know you're doing very well but those will naturally just come up on the car uh, as you can see the bumper you've got a few light scratches just here on the front right bumper the, the parking sensors are all in working order those all work perfectly fine same with the rear ones as you can see um, I'll just show you the rear left, uh, the front left, sorry, bumper, passenger side, all in good condition. As is the wing, as you can see there. Just show the the alloys. So the alloys of the car are in uh, relatively good condition, as you can see. You know, no curbing on this passenger side front alloy there. Um, with the, uh, I believe these are Pirelli tires, I believe. Um, so yeah, it's still got very good tread on those Pirelli tires, so that's ideal. Um, I'll just show you the passenger side door here. You know, you may pick up a few stone chips near the bottom, as you can see, if you were to be really picky and get really close. Wing mirror just has a few little scrapes there, as you can see. Um, show you the rear door there. Again, in nice condition. Show you the rear. So no, again, no curbing on this rear left alloy. Um, clearly ran over something there that's just stuck on the interior but um, just ignore that and again Pirelli tyres on the rear um, but just a bit of bubbling and a bit of the alloy has just come off there uh, the rear quarter panel really nice condition as you can see same with the rear left bumper as you can see you've got your dual exhaust just there your boot in really good condition I'll just show you the inside of it here you know a nice amount of boot space in there as you can see it looks a bit bigger in person i think but you can fit them you know a two fairly large suitcase at least in there um, and definitely your weekly shopping <laughs> that'll definitely fit um so i'll just make my way around obviously you've got your rear parking sensors there as well got a slight little scuff there where the lacquer's come off few little scuff marks there on the rear bumper as you can see just show you again the rear quarter panel on the driver's side is in good condition however uh, and I'll just show you the alloy here again in really nice condition as you can see with again you've got your uh, Pire uh, is that a Pirelli maybe I, I can't tell but anyway it's got a good tread on it um, and then you've got your rear driver's side door here again really good condition so yeah obviously there's a there's a few bits and bobs but i'd say for its year and mileage you know the car is in very very good condition um but yeah that's the exterior i'll uh, i'll just move on to the interior of the car um 
So, obviously, as you can see, I'll just zoom out a bit if I can. You've got your. Um, Let's see if I can just turn off this radio as well and turn off the heaters. Sorry about that. Um, yeah, so you've got your merino champagne interior, uh, obviously leather, um, and then you've got your six speed uh, gear shifter there. Um, and then you've got your front heated seats, your climate control, your rear front parking sensors, um, and then I'll just show you functionality here. So you've got your CD player, your navigation, uh, Bluetooth settings, the speaker system in this is really good. And then you've got your comfort, sport, eco mode, all the rest of that. I'll just show you the dash here. Here's your steering wheel controls also. Um, to show you the mileage there as well. Thought I turned on that. Go, sorry. So yeah, as you can see, I'll just show you the rear as well. You know, plenty space in the rear also. And I love your little feature as well, is you know, rear heated seats as well. Um, have come with the spec of this car also. Um, you know, a good odor in the car as well. No, no bad smells or anything. Um, the only noteworthy thing of the interior of the car is on this left-sided rear seat, you've just got a few dim spots just there and there and a slight bit there um, that we've been un unable to take out. So, But that's the only noteworthy thing of the interior, I'd say. The rest is in uh, nice condition. As you can see, you know, there's no stitching problems or anything like that. Um, just those dim spots that are just a slightly different color something's clearly you know dyed the leather and those just spots there but yeah um apart from that uh that's everything um i could possibly say about the car um if there's any further questions or anything you'd like to see on the car um do let us know uh, we look forward to uh, getting back to you and bye for now